Hello everybody, this is Aviation Blue Tech coming to you with another video. Uh, today's video is going to be my second unboxing uh, video. Um, I took the liberty of taking it out of the box to, to uh, save some time. Um, I have here, uh, I believe it's nine models. Uh, uh, the Kuwait 777-300 uh, from Phoenix. The United 737-700 uh, from Gemini Jets. Uh, Delta 737-900 uh, Sun Country 737-800 which is an older model but it's very hard to find uh, I'm glad I got it, I was looking for it for a while uh, Latam uh, 320neo uh, Aeros Classic uh, Diva Airbus uh, uh, Airbus 320neo uh, Aero Classic uh, Spirit uh, A320neo uh, Herpa uh, British Airways uh, 318 and Volaris uh, 320 uh, Neo. So uh, let's uh, take them out of the box and uh, let's uh, begin the the preview. Okay, so let's go over the Kuwait the uh, Triple Seven uh, 300. Uh, registration is uh, nine kilo dash Alpha Oscar Charlie uh, from Phoenix Models. Uh, and I gotta tell you, man, this has uh, gotta be one of my favorite models. Uh, I mean, the detail and the color and and just uh, the quality of the the model. It's uh, I would almost gotta get. I mean, I would say it's a perfect score, uh, ten out of ten. I did not find any flaws with this model. Um, the font of the of the Kuwait symbol, the color of the, I mean, the engines, the landing gear, the wings, uh, everything on it is, uh, pretty much, uh, perfect. Um, uh, so I really do recommend this model. Um, uh, and I will be using it on the JFK, uh, airport. Uh, so if, uh, if you get a chance, get this model because, uh, you will not be, uh, uh, it's, you know, it's, I guess it's, <laughs> I can't say enough about it, so let me turn around on this side. Yeah, I mean, it is uh, it is a beautiful model. I'm very impressed with it. Um, so uh, if you have a, a JFK model of your own or, or a European um, airport, I would, uh, I would highly recommend it. Uh, next is uh, the United uh, 737-700 from Gemini. Uh, it's a, uh, it's uh, I like the model. Uh, basically, uh, you know, it's just it's kind of stubby looking for you know it is a 700 model. Uh, it looks a little funny, <laughs> so being so short. Um, but uh, yeah, the um, this mold I think the older mold did look a little more proportional for some reason. I don't know what it is. Uh, I don't know if it's the land gears or I'm not sure what you know. But you know, it uh, it is very detailed. You know, uh, I I recommend it if especially if you got the United uh, um, airports. Uh, let me uh, turn it on so you can see. I will be using it uh, once I do uh, the LAX uh, airport. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's uh, very, uh, very highly detailed. Uh, so uh, if you get a chance, uh, grab this model. Okay, so next uh, we have the Delta 737-900. Uh, uh, registration is November 855 Delta November and uh, again this one is a very nice model I love the Gemini uh, 737-900 uh, mode uh, as you can see on the on this one you see how the landing gear in the front it's uh, more proportional you know it's, it's kind of is the 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 perfect uh, size for it compared to the 737-700 so uh it's a uh, very detailed nice uh, uh on the bottom i believe it has the the delta sign 
it's uh, very nice let me uh, turn it around um, as you can see uh, the, the scimitars uh, just everything about it, it's uh, very nice I like it another an, another one here from Gemini uh, I highly recommend it and you will see it on my uh, JFK uh, uh, airport and uh, and my uh, also the when I do uh, in the future the LAX you will definitely see this airplane so uh, this is another one that you definitely need to get if uh, if um, yeah, for your model airport. Uh, next model is uh, Latam uh, Airbus 320 Neo. Uh, registration is uh, Papa uh, Tango Dash uh, Tango Mike November uh, with the Pratt uh, with the Pratt uh, engines on. Um, this one, it's a very nice model. Uh, it actually uh, it uh, the 320 mode on this one it's uh, it actually came out really nice uh, the only uh, issue that I see on this one is the engines I believe are too big for it uh, even though like I said it does look uh, <laughs> it looks uh, you know it does look nice with it but it's not realistic it's a little too big for it, uh, the airframe uh, it's probably about 10% to 15% too big. I uh, will show later on on the later down when I show the Spirit with the same engines on the Eric Classic. That one is, seems to be more closer to uh, being realistic. But it, other than that, it's a very nice model. It uh, is. It is. Uh, is uh, the paint job is uh, one of my favorites out there. So uh, actually, let me turn it around so you can see the other side. It is a beautiful model, and uh, um, I don't know where I'm gonna be able probably when I do maybe for Lauderdale. Uh, I know they do fly the 319 into uh, MCO, um, so I'll see uh, maybe in the future uh, on the schedule if they do fly it somewhere uh, in, uh, in the south. Uh, uh, you know, you will see you will see it on those type of airports. So okay, on to the next one. Okay, so moving on, you got the Spirit Airlines uh, 320 Neo. Uh, as you can see, uh, the, they actually uh, they they did a good job on this one. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, I forgot the registration. It's uh, November 901 uh, November Kilo. I do believe this was their first Neo. I could be mistaken, but I I believe it was. Um, so. Again, the engines uh, compared to the Gemini on the on the on the Neo engines, I do believe are uh, closer to to um, the real uh, thing. Um, so uh, you know, again, uh, the details not as detailed as the uh, Gemini jets, but uh, other than that, it uh, you know, it, it, they actually did a nice uh, nice job on this model. Uh, you will see this uh, when I do the LAX model, uh, and uh, later on uh, MCO. So uh, if you get a chance, uh, definitely get this model. Let me turn it around to see the other side. There you go. Um, yep. So I do recommend it. Uh, uh, so if uh, if you really want to get a a spirit. Uh, Airlines uh, airplane uh, and the Neo. Uh, this is it. Uh, next is the Volaris uh, Airbus 320 Neo. Uh, uh, registration is November 528 Victor Lima. I guess it has a US registration. Uh, again, uh, very nice. Uh, you know, they again, they the, the small, they're you know, they they did a really good job on it. Um, uh, as you can see, uh, so Air Primel uh, Airbus 320, the Norte America, that's in Spanish. Uh, so, and in the bottom of Volaris, it says very, very nice. So, um, you will see this one um, when I do uh, 
LAX, I do believe they fly there, and also um, uh, into uh, MCO. Uh, let me turn it around. There you go. I mean, there's again, um, they did a really good job on, on these uh, Aero Classic A320, uh, so I do highly uh, recommend. So let's move on to the next model. Okay, so here's um, my last model for the video is the British Airways Airbus 318 from Herpa. Uh, registration is uh, Golf Dash uh, Echo Uniform November Alpha. Uh, and uh, I gotta say, uh, uh, it is uh, for you know for the size of the model, and uh, you know I usually don't buy Herpa. But I needed to get this one for my JFK model since they fly the 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 from uh, London. Uh, not uh, yeah, they do fly from London. I think it's Lo Lothan, uh London City, I believe, and then they go to Shannon and then JFK. So I definitely needed to get this one for my JFK airport, and I'm glad I did, and I'm glad they got you know it came out when it did. So uh, you would definitely see it probably on my next. Uh, uh, JFK airport update arrivals because uh, it's actually um, it gets into JFK around 2 p.m. so um, it's a very nice model it's very detailed uh, as far as uh, you know uh, on the aircraft it doesn't have any uh, no antennas or anything like that but as far as the model itself I'm very impressed uh, it almost looks like the old uh, Gemini uh, Gemini Jets uh, 320 mold, which I really liked. Uh, so, uh, uh, you know, I, I really do like it. Uh, let me turn it around. Uh, so I'm very impressed with this one. Uh, for those that, uh, you know, uh, were thinking about it, or here it is. Uh, um, it's a very nice model, and I'm glad I got it. So anyway, so uh, that's it on this model. Well, this concludes uh, this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, my next uh, video is probably going to be uh, my JFK uh, JFK uh, airport arrivals uh, 2 to 2.30 p.m. Uh, so uh, if you want me to do a specific review on any of these models or any other models, uh, just uh, let me know. Uh, well, until next time, uh, take care.